Well, Mike Riley makes his return to the state of Oregon on Saturday at 1.30 on Fox as they visit Austin Stadium in the Oregon Ducks, coming off a major win in Willie Taggart's air as they kicked it off with literally a 100-yard kickoff in the start of the 2017 campaign. I think there's three big reasons to watch this game. Number one, utilize the hashtag StompOutCancer. The uniforms that Oregon will be wearing will literally have been created by three young individuals who are at the Children's Cancer Hospital in nearby Portland, as well as help designed by three student athletes. So I think that's pretty interesting, so tune in for that reason. But from the football standpoint, I love to watch this game because I'm look at the wide receivers of Oregon. They're a very young group and untested in week one. How do they play against a very physical defense, a secondary of Nebraska, but they're very confident in right now. I'm looking forward to watching Johnny Johnson, true freshman, how well does he play? How well does Charles Nelson play? Now being the senior of that group, I think they're gonna have to make plays behind the arm of Justin Herbert. When you look back at the film a week ago, that Nebraska defense gave up a ton of yards in the air. And then of course the physical element. Everybody wanted to look at this new look defense of Jim Levitt and the Oregon Ducks. So how do they do against one of the more physical teams they'll face all season long? Can those true freshman defensive tackles led by Jordan Scott be physical enough up front at the point of attack? Can Troy die at the middle linebacker position take on block down after down late into the fourth quarter and make a stop when they need? That will be the element that I'll be looking for. So overall, stomp out cancer. Can the young wideouts play well? And how does that defensive front seven Oregon do against a very physical Nebraska team? Well, tune in 1.30 on Fox. Nebraska and Mike Riley come back to Oregon to face the Ducks.